All right, so let's give you a typical day if I'm uh, meal prepping in a different way. There's two ways that I meal prep. This is my breakfast every morning. It doesn't matter. Um, eggs, some spinach, maybe some cheese. Depends on how I feel. And oatmeal, about half a cup, maybe a little bit less, or a packet with some healthy fats. Almonds is in there and cinnamon. And then this should last me, these items last me for a day. Um, I have some quinoa. Usually I'll replace my oatmeal with uh, quinoa, but I'll probably have this uh, another day, not sure. But this is what I'm pretty much going to be eating today for um, my kind of like cleanse or just kind of getting all of my vegetables in. Um, I have a salad that has avocado in it. I buy a lot of salads like these and these type of um, containers from Myers. Uh, I have a video on it where I show you I purchase these kind of salads. So I reuse these and I already have my own made salad in here with cucumbers, spinach, and avocado. So I may add some chicken breast to it or some other things like other vegetables like tomatoes, onions, and peppers and things like that. And then my shakes. Um, these are from last night. I prepared them last night. And spinach and cucumbers as of right now. Um, I usually add um, almond or coconut milk, uh, banana, or some kind of fruit into it. Cherries maybe or strawberries or all of the above. And protein powder or protein shake. So this would be what I would pretty much uh, have throughout the day. And then my salad would be my dinner with maybe um, some chicken breast or um, a, just the salad. It depends. So in here are all of my teas. This is what I usually have first thing in the morning before I eat my breakfast. Um, I like black tea. I do have green tea and some non decaffeinated tea but um, I prefer um, black tea because it has the right amount of caffeine that helps for my workouts and gives me energy in the morning and I do this quite often when I'm cycling out my pre-workout or my fat burners I never take my fat burners or pre-workout um, along with any tea I don't drink coffee I may be one day but right now uh, black teas or caf caffeine um, teas work for me so these are my favorite that uh yogi detox uh tea is like my favorite it's the best ever and right now the only supplements that i am dealing with uh is my one a day vitamins and fish oil and here i do have um my fat burners i only have a week left of those so i'm kind of giving myself a break in just dealing with these and here is my we isolate protein that i put with my shakes so yeah that's what's in here and what i'm using as a I just finished cooking dinner for the family and meal prepping for the next hmm, two to three days actually um, this is dinner for the family uh, try to keep it close to healthy for them and foods that they enjoy I am NOT really a processed food eater as you might notice um, this is a stew I just learned how to make from a recent detox that I did uh, the seven day detox drop I'm actually having that for dinner with some tofu because now I have love for tofu now but this is the dinner that everyone else is having and I'm actually going to include this turkey in my meal prep for the next couple of days uh, what I have here, broccoli and rice, uh, I tend to have an apple with it, probably half of that apple, if not all of it. And I roast it or put it in the oven and with some walnuts and a little bit of honey and cinnamon. And it's just an awesome pre 
or post-workout meal for me. So I have three of these. Um, and then I have three dinners or something that may be a post-workout meal or pre-workout meal. All of them can be pre or post-workout. Um, just preferably, um, I like to eat these during the lunch time or dinner. Most of the time I like to eat dinner with the family. So whatever I cook for dinner that day, more than likely I'm going to eat it. And that stew is what I cooked for dinner for myself and for lunch for my husband along with some sandwiches I'm going to make so that he'll have something to eat while he's out working on the road. So yes, these are my three. I like uh, brown rice. Um, I, this is my favorite. Brown rice, um, broccoli, and apples. Put it all in the oven with some walnuts. Drizzle some honey over it. It's just awesome. Um, and then kind of like my dinners, I have my carbs in here, my proteins, and my vegetables and all three of them. And this one, I'm gonna put the smoked turkey in. That way I'll have my vegetables, protein, and my carbs. I have quinoa, carrots, some more turkey that's in here. And then I have some um, sweet potato, chicken, and some broccoli. And honestly, guys, these are snacks for me. Like any in between meals like these, um, these are my snacks. I love these salads. These are the um, berry and pecan spring mix salads that I get from Myers. I'm actually going to buy some more of them. I already have two in the refrigerator right now. And one could last me two days. So this is about four days of somewhat of a snack for me with some dressing. And um, I have half of an avocado. So that's why it lasts me about two. That way I have healthy uh, fats during my snack time. There are other snacks that I would enjoy as well, but this is actually my favorite type of snack because it has the fruits, the veggies. Um, it's got the fats, walnuts in here, or pecans rather, and then I can use my avocado with it as well. And then the most important thing that I have learned, thank goodness, is to drink more water. This is the equivalent of two glasses of water, which is the first thing that I have in the morning with some lemon. Um, and I like to have it warm. So this is not necessarily in a refrigerator. I kind of sit it out if that makes sense. Or I might prepare it as a detox water that's with the, um, mint leaves, cucumbers, lemons, uh, ginger root, I'll put that in there and that would be what I drink first thing when I wake up and I usually drink this and take my supplements, which would be my vitamins, multivitamins and maybe a fat burner because um, I can talk more about fat burners later. And then these are the equivalent of eight glasses of water. This one has four, this one has four because each of them are a liter. So totaling all of this, this is about 80 um, ounces of water uh, you want to drink water that is at least and I say at least half your body weight so 80 uh, you put that together that's 160 I actually weigh a little bit under that about 156 155 I try to stay somewhere in that area as of right now and um, it was a challenge at first but now I'm getting the hang of it so First thing in the morning, finish this by 2 o'clock, finish this by 6 o'clock. That's kind of how I do it. And I drink a large bulk of my water earlier in the day because I work out. And it's actually easier for me. But sometime after 4 o'clock, it can get kind of hard. So um, first thing in the morning, finish by 2, finish by 6 or 8 o'clock. And I'm drinking all of the water that I need for yeah, the day. Yeah, that's pretty much it guys uh this would last me like i said for about two to three days i meal prep on sundays and mondays so mondays is kind of like finishing off the week or getting started for the following week and i'm pretty much good uh it keeps me on track uh you wondering do i measure yes i do i have a measuring cup especially for my carbs as far as my vegetables and my protein i'm pretty good at um proportioning it with my hands so other than that yeah that's it